Your girlfriend came when you were in the shower. She left you something. She showed up, but I guess they can stick around. I hope she didn't go see her father again. I don't want to talk about Todd Maynard right now, okay? I don't either, but I have no choice. Why? He threatened to kill me last night. Just who am I hurting, Blair? Star's dad threatened you? What do you say? A lot of things. He especially enjoyed the part about my overdose. What? Star must have told him, which means you must have told her. Anna, Star and I, we don't keep secrets from each other. Okay, but I made it clear just to keep it between us. You know, she swore she would. I guess she had her fingers crossed. Anna, I'm sorry. I don't blame you. You trusted her, but she took the worst moment of my life and made it into something her sicko dad could throw in my face. So when Todd... Wait, wait a minute, how, how did he even get a chance to talk to you? I went to see him. You, you went to see him? After everything he's done to my mom? You were terrified of the guy. Why would you go anywhere near him? I did it for you, Cole. I did it for you. I couldn't stand watching them drag you back here yesterday. So I went to Mr. Manning's room and asked him to drop the charges. I can't believe you did that for me. It didn't work. It just pissed him off. And made him say things like, People who cross him are never heard from again. Yeah, he was just trying to scare you. Don't worry, look, you know, I'll talk to Nora. Maybe we can get you some police protection. Police aren't going to protect me from what's about to come out in court. What do you mean? Now that Stars told him about my overdose, he's going to tell his lawyer, and then everyone's going to know how stupid I was about Ford and how he ended up dumping me. Oh. God, kill me now. <laughs> and I'm so sorry. I just wanted to do what Star wouldn't do. Go to bat with her dad for you. I'm sorry. Do you two want to be alone? You two are just friends, and now you're holding hands through the bars? I just wanted to make sure Cole was okay. Oh, yeah? What lies were you telling him this time? I'll see you later, okay? Thanks for coming. Thanks for everything. Why? Why are you thanking her? I have a question for you first. What were you thinking telling your dad about Hannah's overdose? You know, before Hannah was ashamed, okay? She didn't want anyone to know. But I told you because I don't want secrets between us. Star, I trusted you. I wouldn't have said one word if Hannah hadn't have lied about my dad. So excuse me if I don't feel like protecting your little friend's privacy anymore. He threatened her. You know that? Well, he, she did a lot worse by making up that bogus story about him. And what was she doing talking to my dad anyway? She went to ask him to drop the charges. She was trying to help, which is more than I can say for you. Cole, I have been trying to help you the right way, okay? I went to see Nora. When? 
this morning. What you say? Unless there is proof that my dad bribed the judge, there is nothing I can do. Okay. So make your dad admit to it. Oh, wait. <laughs> That's right, because you don't think he did it either. He didn't. Star, why do you keep lying to yourself? You're the one who's lying to yourself. And it's about Hannah. Can't wait to hear how you explain that to Hope one day. Star. I hope you got the picture that your daughter made for you. Star, wait! I'm gonna sue this department for brutality. Yeah, good luck with that. Drag me out of the hospital. You don't think that's grounds for excessive force? Ask Marty about excessive force. Last time, John. 